You're about to date the most men we've ever had. Um, We're here for that. <laughs> Get ready for twice the drama when The Bachelorette returns July 11th with two Bachelorettes, Rachel Rakia and Gabby Windy. Get in, loser. We're going shopping. For a husband. <laughs> but before they start handing out roses... I'm ready. Let's do it. <laughs> Some Bachelor Nation alums are ready to start dishing. And what can I say? I'm no stranger to stepping behind that mic. This is making me feel like we're back in, we're back to podcasting again. Get the two of us together. No, it's weird. It's weird vibes. I feel like this is a, an episode of Bachelor Happy Hour. I miss it. I miss it. It's like Rachel. It's like it's like riding a bike. <laughs> I mean, it's definitely way different from when you when you and I did Happy Hour together. But Michelle is here to stay. And it's been wonderful. Newly engaged, Becca Kufrin is the host of Bachelor Happy Hour podcast, along with co-host Michelle Young, where they take fans behind the scenes of all things Bachelor. So much went down this past week. I want to get into the proposal. When did you know that you wanted to propose? We had talked about getting engaged. We knew that eventually this relationship would lead to marriage and we want to spend our lives with each other. But it was when I was deep in tour life and I was traveling and you know, the schedule was chaotic, but Thomas stepped up in such a way that I've never seen a partner do before. And he held down the fort at home and he was still 112% invested in me and our relationship and supporting me while I was on tour that I was like, I'm always preaching an equal partnership and 50-50 and meeting halfway and putting in the effort. So. Why is there so much pressure being put on Thomas to propose? Like, why not just do the same and show him how committed I am? And so I started putting that plan together in April and it just came to fruition. And I knew he was also planning something and he still wants to propose. So I didn't want to take away from that, mm -hmm. but I was like, I wonder if he's going to beat me to the punch. But also he's much more slow than I am and I'm very impatient. I mean, I didn't get down on one knee, but asked him to marry me on May 15th. Did you think about how people would respond? There has been some comments of like people saying that's not right or she's desperate, which to me, I'm like, what? Like, logically, that thought process doesn't make sense to me. No, so I just tune them out. I just tune all of all of the haters out. So I knew it was gonna rock the boat in Bachelor Nation a little bit, but I didn't care. I was like, you know, as long as it works for us and our families are supportive and on board and can give their blessing, that's all that matters. I knew that, I mean, I knew he just on a personal level was gonna be so shocked. He had no idea it was coming. And I knew from a public standpoint, people were gonna be like, what the heck? Like, that's so different. That's what Bachelor fans might be saying after listening to the Talking It Out podcast hosted by Mike Johnson and my husband, Dr. Brian Abasolo. Is that a fact or not? Where they hold nothing back. Not gonna lie, sometimes your hot topics conversations have trickled in into the Abasolo household. These important issues that come up, these cultural moments, personal stories, and what we do is take those and take a deeper dive and unpack those with the cast members. And if you're looking for the juiciest news and gossip, it all goes down on the Clickbait Podcast with Bachelor fan favorites Joa Mobley, Natasha Parker, and Tia Booth. Really, y'all getting back together? Your dream guest. Brianna, come oh, girl. Oh, yeah. Amazing. Riri, where you at, girl? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna say Rachel Lindsay. That's what I'm gonna say. <laughs> Joe, uh, right. I wanna have uh, Gabby and Rachel on just to hear about their season. See if they'll tell us anything. Don't miss any of the tea. All Bachelor Nation podcasts are available now. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.